Hello all, welcome to my channel, Ready Art Tarot. I am your girl, Highly in Tune, and I welcome you all to my space. Please be aware, there will be trigger moments, everything will not resonate. So take the resonance and leave a breath for whoever else. Flip and switch the situation, however it pertains to you and your life. He can be a she, she can be a he, and vice versa in other areas. If you're new, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. And what's up, y'all? Cause Taurus, I got your back. What's up, Taurus? How y'all feeling today? How y'all feeling today? How y'all feeling? What's going on with Taurus love life? What's going on with Taurus person? What we need to know? What messages get to Taurus? What does Taurus need to know and be aware of when it comes to person on their mind? What does Taurus need to know and be aware of when it comes to the matter of the heart? What does Taurus need to know and be aware of when it comes to the person on their mind? When it comes to love. Alright, Taurus. Hope everyone is well today. <clears throat> Alright, let's see, Taurus. Oh, no. Okay, so there's an ace of water here, so this person could be a Pisces Cancer Scorpio, or maybe they just have a lot of love and regret. like this person loves you or this person could be a water sign right there's an ace of cups here there's an ace of cups for somebody here and i feel like whoever they gave this ace of cups to they regret it there was a lot of deception and temptation in this situation whoever they gave this damn cup to all right and now they're feeling rejected and lost because they didn't go towards their fate and their destiny which i feel is you okay ace of water Why is the ace of water here? Yeah, this person could be deep in their thoughts about who they gave this cup to. They knew they messed up giving this cup to somebody else. Regret. They regretting it because they, they fell for the sensation and the lies. Regret. They regret trying to control the situation. and deception this just have to do with Taurus uh, Taurus need to know about this deception and temptation and that's why they couldn't offer you no love they were deceiving themselves from temptation of giving you, offering you this love Taurus, rejection and loss now they feel rejected and lost mm. yeah they feel like you've closed the cycle. Something's changed here. Mm. Faith, detours, destiny. Mm. Putting limits to their fears. So this person, I feel, gave this cup to somebody, all right? And they could have been, like, really deep in their thoughts about why did they give this cup to someone, Okay why why did i give this cup to somebody why did i feel that this was my person and i guess as they're thinking about this situation they're regretting it because they know that they want to control they not only wanted to control you they also wanted to control this person they wanted to make things work out in both favors so they can have you both all right there was a lot of deception and temptation here where this person did want to offer you love, but they had so much temptation and so many people in their ear. They had so much going on with society and toxicity that they didn't know how to offer you this love. So now that this cycle is closing out, this person is feeling rejected and lost because they didn't go towards their fate. But I feel now as they're noticing that they didn't go to the, towards their fate, they're starting to put limits to their fears. Mm -hmm. Isolating thoughts. Twin flame. 
control tactic. Yeah, now they know that you're their twin flame. Control. They knew that you were their twin flame. They know being with you was going to bring them some type of abundance here. Venus, offer of love. Yeah, passion the beginning. Cycles change, completion. Feel guilty for sabotaging this connection. Yeah. Limits and fears. Limitations and fears. Because they were not open to receive. So this person needed to go towards their fate. And they needed to limit their fears because they were not open to receive, like, the guidance that spirit gods, angels were giving them to come towards you. They were not listening to the fact that you were their twin flame. They were doing their own thing. Let's see with this water. All right, I don't want to use these. I want to love, use my love triangle deck. And where the hell did I put them at? Okay, so... So, Spirit, you trying to tell me it's not meant for me to use that deck? Spirit, say don't use it. I can't find it, Taurus. Hold on, Taurus. All right. <laughs> so let's talk about this Ace of Water spirit, Taurus. So yeah, this person is now realizing you're their twin flame. You're their abundance. You're their celebration. You're their gift. Spirit gifted you to this person to have a passion in the beginning with them. And they sabotaged it because they were not open to receive not only God and Spirit's guidance, but also the love that you were trying to give them. So they started off, gave this Ace of Cups to somebody, and they regret it. Because it was a lot of deception and trickery. And now they feel lost because they knew that they should have went towards their faith. Alright, so let's see. What's this water, this Ace of Water here, Spirit? Ooh, what is this? Steal these stuff. All right. What's this ace of water? Taurus needs to know and be aware of here. Yeah. They went and gave that ace of cup to somebody else and broke your trust. And that's why they're regretting it. They feel unworthy because they were, they made you feel unworthy because they were very risque. They were jumping their ass on out there. Yeah. It's like. <clears throat> Mm. They were really risque, okay? So, yeah, this person went and gave somebody an ace of cups, and they broke your trust. Let me pull one more on this ace of cups. Ace of cups, you broke your trust. Yeah. Now they just want to be single and be friends. Or they could have told you that they were single and they didn't want, they wanted to be your friend because they were breaking your trust by giving this Ace of Cups to somebody else. Mm -hmm. Let's keep going. Regret. What is this regret towards the person on Taurus mind? What are they regretting here? They regret moving on with this person. They regretting this. There's a lot going on at the bottom of this deck. So this person could be married to the other person or they put you in a friend zone because they were a cheater. And you were single, so they made you as a secret lover because they were already in a relationship and they were married. Something like that, Taurus. I don't know. I ain't about to deal with 
pig at the bottom. Deception, temptation. Yeah, they regret leaving you behind, moving on from you because of this deception and temptation. What's this deception and temptation? Damn, sex. They was tempted by sex with this person. This other person that they were dealing with, they were tempted by sex. They could have been going to the hotel with this person. <clears throat> yeah, <clears throat> and had you feeling like you were just, you could have, they could have been going to the hotel with this person and they could have left you behind and you just felt like you were stuck in this relationship. I feel like their friends know about them cheating. Yeah, because of this temptation and deception, this person was having sex with another person. Rejection and loss. Jeez. <laughs> Rejection and loss. They were they could have been dealing with an ex. So whoever this was, this ex, they rejected their ass. Yeah, look. They going through a separation. They, they separated from this person. They're not speaking. So there could have been a rejection from an ex. Maybe this is the ex that they gave this cup to up here in the front that they broke your trust with. And they reject what they did. And now I feel like they feel like you're moving on. Because of the, de the deception and the temptation of sex with this ex that they're going through some type of loss with. What's this fate here? Taurus need to know about that person. Yeah, remember I said they need to go towards their fate, but they're lying to their self. Okay, they're lying. They haven't went towards their fate. They need to go towards their 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 fate. They need to take. They need to go a detour, go toward divine intervention or something because they're dealing with a lot of lies, okay? They could have broke up with this person that they were in a, going to the hotel with, like this somebody that they could have been in a, a marriage with or something or a very, um, could have been their main person. <clears throat> I don't know. Or you could be the main person. But whatever it is... Someone is feeling rejected and lost over an ex, okay? And they needed to go towards their fate and destiny, which was you. But they were dealing to, listening to the lies, okay? They were lying to you, and they were, the other people were lying to them. And that's why they didn't go towards this detour and take this, this faded, go towards this faded meeting, thoughts, isolating. Yeah, so whoever they gave this cup to, this could have been somebody's wife that they're not speaking to. So they could have been thinking about this person, you know what I'm saying? Like, damn, I gave this cup to this person and this person was married or what's this wife have to do with a uh, tourist person? Stalking. So I'm feeling like they're not speaking to this person. This person could have been somebody's wife. What's this wife uh, to Taurus person? Who is this wife to Taurus, Taurus person? Unrequited love, <clears throat> red flags. So yeah, this was a wife. So they're not speaking to this person because they're somebody's wife. Tell me about this wife. Oh, who? Look, I said, tell me about this wife. She got a husband, okay? Mm. They're not speaking to this wife because she has a husband. They gave their, they look, red flags. They seen it wasn't, look. Mm. Oh my God, Taurus, look at this. Love triangle, secret lover. Your person could have been the third wheel and the love and the secret lover. Mm. They were only flirting and, and getting with this person for money anyway. It wasn't nothing serious. This person was in two relationships. They was in a toxic relationship and a regular relationship. Or this relationship just could have turned into a toxic relationship. Mm-hmm. 
flirting with this person for money. Love triangles, unrequited love. Mm. Tell me about this uh, fate with these lies, spirit. Tell me about these lies here. I want to know more about these lies. Yeah, they were lying about a star-crossed lover. They were lying about who they were dealing with and who they were messing with. They were manipulating you. I don't know if they were manipulating you to take you to the hotel or manipulating you because they were at a hotel. Control. They regret what they did because they feel like you're moving on now because they were too tempted by sex with this ex. And they were lying to you about this person. And now they're not speaking to this person because they found out that this person is married with a husband. Control. Yeah, they controlling the decision of what? They want they want to have unplanned pregnancy here now. So they're regretting. Alright, so they're stuck in their head thinking about this, you know, because they're not speaking to this wife because they have a husband. They made a decision to get this person pregnant just to control them, to have power over their money. Mm. This person was text messaging them and stalking them. And this person wanted to control this person. This person was actually sitting here thinking about this person while they were not speaking all right and they were trying to control this person by offering them some type of love here but the cycle closed and i feel like now your person's trying to put some type of limits to their fears because in their thought as they're not speaking to this person they're still got this wife stuck in their head but their control tactics to keep this person with where they want them to be at they made a decision to try and get this person pregnant to have control over their money so they can keep continuously being around them to spend their money. Venus offer. They could have tried to offer this person love, but they closed the cycle. Venus offer. What's this spirit? Damn, I mean, the hotel, see, they go to the hotel with this person late at night. So when they went to the hotel late at night, they could have told this person, hey, look, I want to be with you. Let's be together, you know? And they was like, and, and something, they, but somebody feel unworthy here because somebody's cheating. Somebody's sleeping with somebody else. Like, ugh. Yeah, so they wanted to offer them some type of love here. They wanted to be with this person, you know, just to go to the hell, hotel with them late at night and get what they want out of them. But, you know, they don't feel right about this no more because they know that they're cheating on their husband, I feel. Yeah, so now they feel unworthy about this cheating. They don't want to cheat no more. I feel like they put your friend, uh, your person in a friend zone, even though they felt like this was their wish come true. Mm -mm. Yeah, they offered them some type of love, so they'll go to the hotel with them late at night. You know, but I feel like the cycle is changing, it's closing here. What's this cycle? What's this change? What's this completion? meeting up you want to close the cycle they're going to close the cycle here with this third party meeting up with them because they stuck in a relationship with somebody else they want to reconcile but they're angry though they might can't ain't, ain't, uh, reconcile with this person they could be calling them trying to flirt with them on the phone but somebody had an unexpected visitor I guess this is where they made this decision to have this unplanned pregnancy. Well, it looked like to me somebody came on after work. They went home, checked the toilet, and it was red. I'm sorry. But I'm just saying what it is. <laughs> they want to meet up with this person, closing the cycle, but they stuck in a relationship. They ain't have no choice. Yeah, the whole plot twist. They have no choice but to close this cycle. Somebody's moving here because they betrayed them. 
somebody also will get a divorce so they can be in a relationship again with somebody but there's insecurities here because somebody was secretly getting away with someone and they want to reconcile but this is really making somebody angry yeah they closed the cycle because they wanted to meet up with this person but this person was stuck in a relationship with their person limitations to fears so I guess now they're starting to let go of things and focus more on their twin flame. Yeah. Now they put limits to their fears. Now they know that they were just a rebound. Now they're figuring it out. See, they're figuring out that they were being manipulated. They're figuring out that this person treated them like a rebound. This person didn't want your person. Look. They fighting because they put them in a love triangle. Your person probably didn't even know that this person had a whole husband somewhere because they was at the hotel all the time. They weren't going to this person's house. They was going to the hotel. If I see hotel one more time, I'm going to slap the shit out of myself. But I'm just saying. <laughs> and then look what else coming up. All right, love triangle keep popping up and fighting. They was fighting because they put this person in a love triangle. Being charming and stuff, playing roles like they single. Uh-huh. But then they got caught in the act. I feel like a co-worker must have told them. Like, look, that person ain't single. That person got a whole husband or a wife. And look, now they unhappily married. <clears throat> because they wanted to be in multiple relationships. Mm, but yeah, your person is putting limits to their fears. Because now they're realizing that they were a, a rebound. And they were being manipulated. What goes around comes around. Right, Taurus? Shit, this person got a whole relationship here and your person is just the third wheel just barely hanging on. This person was tempting your person with sex and they feel all lost over this ex. So this was the ex they were dealing with that was stringing them around along. Uh-huh. They were lying to them. They had a whole lover. Yep, now they ain't speaking to the wife or this main woman because she got a main man already. You know, not necessarily have to be a wife or a husband. Be a main male, main woman. She was that hold down the fork at the crib. So your person was like, shit, well, I know how to control this situation. I'm going to just bust one up in that. Or I'm going to just not wear a con. You know what I'm saying? But I feel like, yeah. And then they want to offer them some love just because they want to meet up at the hotel. Huh. <sighs> What's this twin flame? Yeah. Finally, they getting out of their fears because they was a fool. They didn't even notice they was a rebound being manipulated. Twin flame. Damn, look at that. Wish come true, twin flame. Aww. They know they made you, they betrayed you and made you feel unworthy. But, um, or this person could have been dealing with a betrayal and feeling unworthy in the situation because this person, somebody had this person as a secret lover and they didn't see the red flags. Not a gossip is. This is the main reason why they were sneaking out. And there was a lot of drama because it wasn't no love given back. So now we're talking about y'all down at the bottom. Twin flying no more. They watching you too. Your twin flame see you as a wish come true and they is stalking you. There could have been a separation and somebody feel guilty about this. <clears throat> mm. Give me one more for twin flame. Wish come true, stalking, twin flame. Yeah, look. They want to reconcile. Look how happy they look together. All y'all cards, y'all notice when I be like, what's going to happen in the future? It always be like, solid foundation. Happiness back together. Somebody's angry and mad and sad all at the same time. Somebody could be at home living in their regret, feeling like they made a big mistake. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this your wish come true. You this person's wish come true. They stalking you, Taurus, because they want to reconcile. Where you at, Taurus? You ain't want to see this person yet? If you didn't, you're going to run into the ass. Go to your store or your grocery store or something y'all usually go to. Go somewhere where 
they be meeting you up at bars and stuff. Watch, they gonna be there stalking you. Don't think they ain't watching you because they is. You know it. If you see that person, already knew they know they knew that you was coming. <laughs> Celebration gifts, abundance. Wait a minute now. Okay, so. Okay, so somebody could have seen the red flags, you know, when this person was telling them that they were single. They knew all along, I feel like, you know, look, the red flags, single. This person seen the red flags, you know, when this person was telling them when they were single. They like, mm -hmm. They probably could have seen stuff that, you know, talking about their relationship. I feel somebody's in a talk was in a toxic connection, but now they're blocking it out. Mm -hmm. Gifts in abundance. What is this about? One more. Okay, so this person was dealing with multiple lovers and they're angry because they know that they caused insecurities in this situation. They know that they're supposed to be celebrating with you, having abundance with you, getting these gifts with you. But all in all, they were with somebody else and now they're angry because they caused insecurities in this relationship hmm. by putting you in a third party situation. Having unexpected visitors pop up, having affairs with somebody that they were calling themselves moving with, but now this relationship is their focal point. This is what they're focusing on. This is what they're thinking about. <sighs> Shit. Yeah, they knew they were supposed to have this abundance. They know that you're the wish come true and they're stalking you because they want to reconcile. They know they fucked up. Ace of Wands. Ace of wand, duh. Ace of fire. Now they want to pass from the beginning. And they trying to strategically plot how they going to get it. Ace of wands. Ace of wands. They trying to plot how they going to marry you. Be charming to you. I feel like wherever they was... They, somebody wasn't getting the love that they needed, okay? This person wasn't making you feel like, you know, they loved you. They cared or anything like that. I don't know. But I feel like, or this person could have had a past, tried to have a passion new beginning with this, with this wife. Because yeah, yeah, this ain't, I don't think this talking about you because first of all, here when we have abundance is the, the womanizer, angry and insecurity. So they knew they, they would have this abundance with you, but they were dealing with somebody else and they caused insecurity. So you like, I don't, I don't want that anymore. So they went and had like a passion, tried to have a passion in the beginning with this person and had to try to strategically plot how they was going to get to this person by charming them because they knew this person was married, right? So what happened in this situation with this ace of wands, this person? They just feel like they not, they not worthy of this anymore. They don't want it no more. They know that there was financial ties or they could have been financially tied to this person with their kids. There could be drama in their family now because this person was going somewhere after work with a co-worker. And it caused um, some sadness in this situation, you know? Feelings was hurt because it's like, damn, where's my love? They were seeing the red flags when they was taking this risk and they seen that someone that was abusive in this situation. That's what really caused the separation. But yeah, this person was trying to have a passion in the beginning with this person or Ace of Wands or they knew they should have had a passion in the beginning with you instead of strategically plotting how to get towards somebody that's already in a marriage and flirt with them because they already knew that they were not worthy. Yeah, now they feel guilty for this shit. Yeah, and they walking on eggshells. So they could be real uncomfortable. They know they fucked up and made a mistake. 
<laughs> and now I feel like this could be y'all dealing with this separation. What's this guilt and sabotage? Guilt. They want to confess now. Nah. They want to confess why they weren't giving you this love. Guilt. Because they were in a toxic connection with somebody else. They could have had feelings for this person's children. This person could make you sad when they call. What about this toxic connection? What's the worst thing you know about this? Yeah. Fighting. I guess the, they feel guilty for sabotaging this connection. So now they want to confess to you the reason why they wasn't giving you the love and, it's, and, and the reason why this connection was toxic and all of this fighting or they could have been in a toxic connection that they were doing a lot of fight with. Now they want to come home and have this relationship with you after having this affair with this person that they call feelings for. What Taurus need to know about this toxic connection here? Yeah unhappily married so they feel guilty that they sabotaged this connection because they want to confess to you the reason why they weren't giving you no love is because because they were in a toxic connection with somebody that was unhappily married and there was a lot of fighting going on y'all all of this was for money all this was for money, basically. Receiving, open and receive in reverse. Open to receive in reverse. So, somebody's not open to receive. Love, guidance, balance, family. They're in denial and they're blocking something out here. Somebody is definitely in a relationship with someone that they're having an affair with, okay? Somebody's having an affair with somebody that's in a relationship, all right? They could be at home, be texting your person. They could have children at home that's sad, wondering where their mama and daddy at all the time. Somebody could call somebody to just cheat, sleep around. All they want to do is whole shit. What's this block got to do with Taurus? They could have put you, they could have put you or trauma, red flags, lust and affairs. Good Lord. Let me hurry up and get out these cards. All right. So, they're not open to receive uh, what they need, the guidance they need to have this family because they're still in denial of situations going on with their life. So, it's causing blockages. So, um, I feel like this friend, person could be dealing with friends or they could have put you in a friend zone or someone in a friend zone or something like that to secretly get away. There's drama here, red flags. There's lust and affairs. And then there's somebody at home in a relationship. This could be the wife. But somebody want to have a lustful affair and somebody's causing drama and someone sees the red flags. What Taurus needs to know about these friends? Dang. What Taurus needs to know about friends? They know about a secret lover or something. Or, yeah, like I said, they blocked you out and put you in a friend zone. Because you are like this person's secret getaway. Hold on. Or, this person is not open to receive. Not open to receive a, ha a family because they're in denial. And they're um, and they're causing blockages because they had this secret lover, 
all right? And they could have tried to put you in a friend zone to secretly get away with this person. This was the gossip that they were taking a risk with this person, not knowing this person was already fucking married. Secret getaway. Yeah, it was causing betrayals within you. Yeah, because look, love triangle. All of this was out of some type of revenge or some type of way to get away with something here. Yeah, somebody got caught in the act cheating. Now they're going through a divorce. Mm. What's the outcome of this situation for Taurus? Okay, what's the outcome situation for Taurus? Oh, Lord. Somebody want to drink, sneak? What's the outcome for Taurus? Come on, cards. Alcohol, sneak out, and... So, somebody want to go out and have some drinks. They want to sneak out. They can text message you. Come on, cards. What else? One more. Sexting. They could text you and sex you some cute, sexy pictures. Somebody also caught feelings and they want to take a risk. They thinking about the past memories of you guys. Alright. So what's the situation with Taurus and that person? What's the outcome? Damn, sadness, this call, shit. Sadness. At a breaking point. One more. You just want to be single. This person calls you sad and shit. You just tired. Like, fuck it. You know what? How about I just be single, bitch? How about I just be single going about my damn business? Yeah, Taurus. I'm, I was trying to find something. But it was a little something in here. They know they're supposed to be with you. They want to reconcile with you. But, oh, Lord. They need to let that uh, lady go, man, go over there with that relationship. Let them go on fend for their own life, you know? Well, I don't know why people be wasting their time and be dealing with other people when you could be in your own relationship, minding your own damn business, but you want to be over here with a married woman and, and all this crap. I don't know. Or a married man or somebody that's in the commitment. You know, Taurus. Oh, poor little. Uh oh. Somebody tired again? Alright, I shuffle these up just for y'all. Oh, I'm sorry, Taurus. Dang, look what pop up. Taurus, the first card. What about Taurus? Something is a painful ending. So somebody could have been dealing with a Taurus, and they could be dealing with a painful ending here. Or Taurus. This could have been a painful ending for you, and you chose right. This person now saying that they want to be serious about you. They feel like this is what the doctor ordered. They needed this loyalty. They feeling stuck right now. This could be a Jezebel man or they could be stuck with the Jezebel man. This karmic is manipulating your person so they don't want to come towards you. This person has hidden secrets. They have multiple lovers. They're a liar. And they're stuck on you. 
feeling stuck and your person stuck on you. So you chose right. Whatever you did, you got your person stuck on you. One more for Taurus. Pregnancy, rebirth, regrowth. I always say that, don't I? Hustler. And one more. Walking in your purpose. Following God in your spirit team. All right, Taurus. And let's get some few messages. Taurus, I got y'all on here for 40. But I had shuffled all these cards for y'all. Not knowing the reading was going to be that long. All right. So this person wants control. And they're intimidated and salty as hell. Look. I feel like because you're controlling your own goddamn life, this person is intimidated and salty and mad as hell about it. Because you're not letting them control you. Yeah, they had a whole commitment with you and they sabotaged it. Shit. <laughs> yeah, with their toxic ways. The things that they were doing. Acting a goddamn fool and using you for your damn money. Or trying to be out here getting in relationships with people for money. Not just you, but other avenues as well. This person could be long distance from you, Taurus. Yeah. Person, shit. Yeah, they have split personalities. They different when they're around you and other people. They always partying and playing games. Yeah. They go to third party right there. I'm always partying, playing games, and always with the third party influences. Would tell me about what's going on here. Hmm. They met they match with this one. And they walked away. They couldn't take it. This person was playing games, partying with these third parties. I don't know. They could have met they match with you, Taurus, and you walked away because they was irresponsible with your fucking feelings. All they wanted to do was come around you for some money. No money, no talk. I don't want to talk to you. You got money? Well, if you don't got no money, then I'm out. Mm. This person tried to make you be out to be a, a distorted feminine, but you're very high vibrational. person could be dealing with some fake ass friends that they be finessing, using. Probably never had no damn money yet and they ain't gonna stop finessing these people. But they talk good shit about you though, Taurus. Even though they like mooching off of you. <laughs> Very one-sided person. This ex-lover you could have been dealing with is a heartbreaker. He breaks hearts out here. Alright. Do a lot of shit for clout and attention. And you un unimpressed. You don't give a fuck. You don't care. Even though you were generous to this person, you had receipts. Damn it. You had receipts on this person that they were all doing this, all of this, whatever they do to get this money or whatever out here, they just do it for cloud. You know? What else? For tour. They could be projecting on stuff on you, but it's like it's being ignored. You don't give a fuck. Okay? One more last one for Taurus. Hmm. Now that they've been definition spying on you, they trying to see if you you more than friends or you got another lover or something, Taurus. Or maybe somebody could be in the LCQ B uh, T uh, crew. Definition spying. They see that, or you could see that somebody's in the Q L T B Q L. How the fuck this L B T Q L B T G Q L B T D Q. Somebody could be in the LBTG, LBTGQ, LBT. I don't know. This shit don't even sound right. I keep saying it. But um, yeah, somebody was definition spying. They see that somebody was more than friends with somebody here. One more. All right. So the last card says, person's a groupie. They eavesdropping on you, and they're very low vibrational. All right, tour. So watch your back out here because you a role model out here and they stalking you. These people trying to stress you out, Taurus, because you know your purpose in life. You a beautiful person and you got evidence for all of this bullshit that's going on. So just because they say they want to come back and they miss you and they want to be back with you forever, don't believe that shit because they sure had the cars fooled the other day too. 
I want to do right. They must have cried that night. <laughs> they must have cried hard that night, Taurus. I want to do right. I love my Taurus. I believe in everybody. Must have been pissed at the other bitch at that time. <laughs> I want to do right. Well, I don't see you doing right. I see you still moping, floping around somebody that's still dealing with somebody else and trying to let go, and it's hard. And ugh, so a little Taurus. I don't know. This love game is some strange shit. That's why I don't want to be in no damn relationship. I rather just sit back and try and help y'all out, man, because I ain't dealing with that shit no more. That shit too much, too complicated. Maybe one day somebody, maybe old, want to sit the fuck down or something. I don't know. I don't got time for these old Jezebel men running around here flopping and dopping and bibbing and bopping. And, man, or these Jezebel women. Shit, both. Everybody. Shit, everybody doing them. This day and age, different. Don't nobody want to be in no relationship no more. Everybody want to just play. Play, 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 play. Now it's time for us to play. Play, 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 play. Shit. If a, if a, if a motherfucker ain't showing you at least 75%, at least 50 that they give a fuck to us, I don't even think you should even give them even 50 either. Give them 10, you know, because we, we gonna love you. We gonna, you know, show you some type of love. I ain't about to sit up and be taken advantage of now, unless I'm just blind as hell and, and boo-boo the damn fool. But yeah, Taurus, that has been your reading. You know they gonna always wanna come back. You know, it's always somebody in the back Somebody else they kicking it with. Somebody else they messing with. It's always a hidden person. Some goddamn where. Well, Taurus, that has been your reading. Until next time, Taurus, I love you guys. Peace.